Full credit to the Senators for staying with it. I mean, they really have. Here's the Banajad, pokes this three. The Banajad in there, can't get a shot away, and then Hiller is run into. Bobby Ryan following hard. That was a big collision at the Calgary Nets. The crazy thing is a goalie will push off the post and the net will come off. And then a 230 pound man runs into it and it doesn't move. <laughs> it's just a it's a hit or miss. And for Bobby Ryan, I mean Zibanejad, what a burst of speed coming out of the zone as Hiller is still down on the ice and they're going to have to have a look at him. And it, it, you're in such a vulnerable position as a goalie, right? You got all that equipment on, you're down, you're trying to locate the puck and you're not expecting someone that large to come crashing into you. And we'll have a look at it and see why exactly he ended up where he did. But both players are being looked at. You look at Bobby Ryan kind of holding his hip flexor and his knee. And this is a pretty good crash. And you'll remember Clark MacArthur ran into Robin Leonard last year, which was a horrific goal crease crash that took both players out for quite a period of time. And, and when you see a crash like that, I mean, everyone's trying to get to the net. It's high velocity here, and these bodies are big, and they're moving. And Looking at Bobby Ryan, Hiller is still it's the backup on the bench. There's no excuse for winning a faceoff and then getting blown by like this. This just can't happen to you. And it was a good job. And there you see the shove of Bobby Ryan from behind. And there's no way he was going to be able to stop himself. Everyone's back checking hard, and that rebound comes out in front, and he literally gets drilled right into Hiller. There's no way he's going to be able to stop. And there's no way he should. I mean, right there you see it. It's full leak, and he really drills him of Hiller, who's going to leave this game. And I'm sure he strained his neck and his back and his <laughs> just about everything. And they're going to call a penalty on this, I believe. Yeah, they just and did. I, and I don't get that. They I just, just did. I just don't get that. Neither does the crowd. They are letting the referees hear it. Goaltending interference. Goaltender interference on Ryan as Yoni Ortio now is to step into this. It's become a shooting gallery.